This is Entrepreneurs Get Visible, the podcast for people who want more impact, influence, and income. I'm Anna Parker Naples, and I'll be sharing with you proven methods from leading entrepreneurs that help you get visible as an authority in your field. Because anything's possible when you get visible. Hey, on today's episode of Entrepreneurs Get Visible, I want to talk through the opportunities that COVID-19 presents you and the lockdown that we're experiencing in terms of creating lasting assets for your business that can position you, that can build your funnel, that can help nurture and give more value to your audience or your new audience if you are just moving into the online space. You are an expert in your field. And if you're not an expert in your field, you certainly have that feeling that you want to become one. That's why you're thinking about becoming a speaker. That's why you want to be running an online business. That's why you're thinking about writing a book. That's why you're thinking about passive income, because you want to find ways to use your knowledge, use your experience to give back to the world. There has never been a greater time to sit back and use this opportunity, an extended opportunity. They're now speaking in the news about three to six months where you will have extra time. Now, it might feel if you have a busy household like I do, maybe you're homeschooling. I have three at home with me. You might feel that maybe you don't have all of that extra time. But I want to say to you, you just need to be strategic about this. In my life, I do have three children at home. I have my husband at home as well now. However, because they're home, yes, they need my attention for homeschooling and some entertainment. But I actually, instead of doing the school run twice a day and then spending 3 p.m. until 8 p.m. running around after my children and basically living in my car, I now have extended periods where I could, if I wanted to, focus on creating. And I want to walk you through today some valuable resources that I've already created on this podcast and point you back to them to get you started with something you might want to create. So first up... The thing you could create is a book. Now, it's no secret that during this time, I am writing my second book. It's called Podcast with Impact. I think it's going to do what it says on the tin and it accompanies the core of my business, the podcast membership. Now, if you want to know about how to create a book, I have got a couple of episodes that I'm going to recommend of Entrepreneurs Get Visible. The first is episode 20, which is about preparing a book proposal. Now, even if you're not planning to send anything out to a a publisher, if you're just going to publish yourself, if you're going to self-publish, this is going to give you all the ways that you need to think about the planning and structure before you get writing. It's exactly what I set down to do about three weeks ago. The other episode I'm going to recommend is number 40, which is about the book writing process, exactly what happened for me and what didn't happen for me. I'm going to throw in a new tip for you. I had loads and loads of trainings and videos and podcasts around podcasting that I have used otter.ai, which is a brilliant online app and a phone app that transcribes everything for free. You can get up to 600 minutes of audio. That's 10 hours per month for free. So if you have content, Facebook Lives, YouTubes that you have delivered on your area of expertise, you could get them transcribed straight away. It takes minutes and then you may well have the outline of a lot of the chapters of your book. Of course, you're going to need to go in and edit and tidy and perhaps make the language more sophisticated. I cannot tell you how much time this is going to save me. And I will be doing that edit before I then send it off to my copy editor. The other thing you could create is a podcast. There has never been a better time to start podcasting. I read three days ago that in the space of five days, there were 19 million hits searching on iTunes for the terms coronavirus or COVID-19. We're all looking for content. We're all looking for ways to survive. We're all looking for ways to make the best of it. Hence the title of this podcast episode and this Facebook Live right now. The next thing, also the best episode to go and listen to for that one on Entrepreneurs Get Visible is podcast episode number 19. And of course, we have the podcast membership, which you can find at thepodcastmembership.com. 
You could get creating a blog. Maybe you've been writing a blog, maybe you've fallen off it and you haven't done it for a while. Well, now is the time to either start one or create lots of backed up podcasts that you can have scheduled to go out for weeks and weeks and weeks. If you're already podcasting, maybe you have show notes that could be turned into a blog. You can find clever ways to repurpose and get that out there. A blog is a powerful way to position yourself. The next thing you could spend time doing... The episode on blogging, by the way, is episode number 30 of Entrepreneurs Get Visible. You could spend time getting yourself on Pinterest for the first time. You could spend time list building. A great episode I have on that is number 22, all about how to get started building your list, the things you need to consider. Even if you already have a list, maybe right now you could start creating an excellent lead magnet to build that list. Maybe you could refresh your lead magnets. Maybe you could re-script your nurture sequences for your emails. Maybe right now, and I think we're seeing a lot of this, you could start creating your own community. There are Facebook groups popping up everywhere, but the ones with great titles that do what they say on the tin are the ones that are growing fast. So how can you take your area of expertise and the situation that we're having right now to build and gather a community? Because that is going to help you and empower you to take your business forward when it feels like the right time for you to put out new products, services and offers. The other thing I want to mention is that right now, So many podcast hosts will be looking for guests because they are going to be batch creating content. I know I am. You could reach out to be a great podcast guest and there is a skill to it. Anyone can be a podcast guest, but there are things you want to know and things you want to deliver and things you want to be secure in your knowledge of. So if you haven't podcast guested before or you know that this is something you want to bring in much more into your podcast strategy, then head over to episode 18 to hear about exactly what I would recommend to really start leveraging that as a strategic opportunity. So there you go. All of a sudden, three to six months, there is so much you can create. I'm going to admit that I have to have a lot of routine in order to get through my days. And the days that I don't have routine, it can all go to pot. But I so far have written six and a half chapters of a book. I have refreshed my website. I have gone in and I've made tweaks and changes to all of my profiles, my LinkedIn, my Facebook, my Instagram. And just giving things that opportunity to give it a fresh eye. What's been out there for maybe 18 months that I've not had a chance to look at? Week by week, give yourself a focus. Let that be the thing you do instead of that Netflix box set. Don't get me wrong, I've done my fair share of that too. But how can you come out of this stronger, in a better position, because you have used this time to build some valuable assets? And it might well be that you actually decide to build a course or structure a group programme. You don't have to waste this time. COVID-19 and lockdown is offering us some opportunities. I'm not going to pretend it's easy, but that time is there. So grab it while you can and let me know. Keep in touch with me. Let me know what you're building. And if this episode prompts you to go out and do something and put your focus elsewhere, then I'd love to hear from you. And I'd love to hear how you're surviving lockdown, isolation or whatever else comes later if you're watching this or listening to this much later on when this is all behind us. That's it from me today. Thank you for listening to Entrepreneurs Get Visible. To get your free checklist on how to raise your profile and to find out about our community, go to annaparkernaples.co.uk forward slash get visible.